show you. Um, this Peronius tertius is a got a deep perineal, uh, deep fibular nerve, and uh, L5 predominantly, some S1. Um, I like this muscle because uh, for studying uh, peripheral neuropathy, uh, it's a more distal muscle than the tibialis anterior. Um, sometimes in mild peripheral neuropathies, the sensory conduction studies may not be that affected, maybe a little affected, um, and the tibialis anterior and aminogastrocnemius is not too involved. Um, so it's a good muscle to show that there's some length dependency in the immune exam. So this one, you're going to find what they call the bimalleolar line, which is basically the line that if there's an imaginary line between the two malleoli. And you're going to go about four to five finger breaths up and then about two centimeters lateral to the tibia here. And then you're going to be in peronis tertius. So it's a pretty superficial muscle. I, I approach the muscle from the side like this. And the maneuver is basically dorsiflexion of the ankle. Bend your foot up just a little bit. There we go. 